hello everyone so today is another video of coma 3 and today we just installed a new fork of Shane um, and we are using the auto version of it so that it will automatically determine what to do like the distance and everything so we are using a Toyota to 2021 prime uh, Prius prime and we are driving in New York Long Island so I'm trying to get into the semi highway so let's see what I can do I said the cruise this is dynamic follow distance it already knows there is a car the steering is I, I, I completely like I'm not holding the steering wheel at all it knows exactly where the car is you can you can see like there is a <coughs> small arrow here it knows the distance the previous version the car stops at least three or four car like it makes a distance of three cars and then it just stops but right now as you guys can see it only stops uh, like very very close to the front car let's see what it can do I'm, I'm not I'm not pushing any steering wheel it does it itself it's pretty good and I'm, I'm completely removing my hand from the steering wheel it turns pretty good oh my goodness wow okay so okay it's it's pretty good yeah so guys as I already said like I have a twi uh, 2020 uh, 2018 my bad 2018 Honda Accord and that car doesn't have torque steering wheel so I really don't know how it's gonna perform on my Honda but right now I'm using my cousin's car and it's doing pretty good bro like it's in we're in a like we're not in a highway first of all we all know open pilot works pretty good on highway most of the part but right now we're in local street it goes pretty good it turns like all the small turns and it's, it's I'm gonna say like it's impressive it's definitely not gonna turn all the way right side because our steering wheel not, is not that much like have that much torque that Tesla has but as you as you guys can see um, okay let's see okay it doesn't stop on a uh, uh, stop sign yet so I have to stop myself and then I'm gonna gain cruise control and yes the another feature of this new fork is if I press um, gas it's not gonna stop so I'm pressing the gas right now and it didn't the, like it didn't stop the uh, open pilot feature this is the new feature of that new fork I'm using right now I never used Shane fork so this is the first time I'm driving my brother just installed it and he just came to my home to show me how it works because he knows like I'm planning to buy one so I'm gonna again stop because and uh, because the stop sign it doesn't work with the stop sign so what I'm gonna do there's a cop's car okay wow that's great I stopped um, I didn't get a ticket by the way guys thank you so what I'm saying also um, if to stop the open pilot feature you have to now just press the brake like Tesla Tesla you have to if you press the brake it is stop itself the autopilot in open pilot you have to press the brake too right now on Shane's fork again we are not using the like main fork right now we're just using um, okay there is a car he didn't he didn't notice and he didn't break that's the that's the dangerous part I, I, I should say because the camera should saw like there is a car just making a left it didn't stop I have to break myself that's a point guys so be careful of that don't just assume that your car is gonna stop immediately like what Tesla does if that's the case of a Tesla Tesla would break immediately but in this case it didn't stop at all I have to like stop myself so again we're gonna turn on the fork the open pallet and uh, I'm gonna increase the speed Oh, I'm, I'm reducing the speed unfortunately. Or is I'm gonna press okay, I'm gonna give some gas and I'm pressing the right now I'm driving 32 on the monitor it says 31. We have 
have a stop sign in front of us. We have to enable this feature. So my cousin said, like, if you want to stop on a stop sign, you have to enable this feature. Probably Shane Fork has that feature. So, so yes. So I will definitely make another video about what it does with uh, stop sign, red light and everything. So again, we're turning that on. 36, let's see if it shows the car or not. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. Yes, so it doesn't, it doesn't show the car. Because it should, because on the monitor I saw he can see the car on the monitor, but I really don't know why it doesn't break. So, which is a bummer, I'm gonna say, but probably in near future, the sensor will work more perfectly or the camera will perfectly, like, work perfectly. So it doesn't even break, but there is a car in front of us. So we're gonna make a left here. This is also a highway, but it has uh, lights. So we'll try to show you guys the lane change and everything. I turn on the feature, it says green. I give a slightly move on. And it knows there is a car. So in highway, it pretty much knows there is a car. But in local road, as you guys can see, uh, in just like probably 30 seconds before it doesn't know like there is a car in front of us Also guys, uh, my cousin said like it can change automatically the mode so it can uh, move to um, traffic mode, it can uh, change to uh, the distance mode like how much distance is going to maintain with the front car and everything. So yeah, it, it automatically changed on the uh, all the modes because of we are using the auto mode right now. So it shift, shift all those um, modes between uh, whenever it needed, you know. So yeah, there is a car and it breaks itself. Fast. Okay, yeah, yeah, it, it slows down. Okay, so because of it slows down and it maintains just one car distance, as you guys can see here, it just maintains one car distance right over here. Yeah, but I, I will still suggest guys to use a uh, little bit more distance because if it doesn't and if it doesn't recognize the car it can hit because you don't have that much time to control your car so i'm gonna say at least maintain two cars distance in highway or like this kind of road where you have to drive like 50 miles yeah so that's it for today guys and we will try to make more videos on open pilot and install more fork from the internet and uh, yes thank you for watching make sure you hit that like button if you uh, want to support my channel thank you so much guys have a wonderful day